for the CZ, uh, CZC auto um, bag that we got, the 60 by 24 by 24. And then we went with a cargo vault, cargo management 60 by 24. Said this review is gonna kind of take you through a trip. So it's not just unboxing type of thing. We're gonna know if this thing works by the end of this, uh, by the end of this trip. And you'll know if this is a good pairing. The reason we got this pairing is because this was big enough to hold the bag. This is the biggest bag we could find, and this was the um, the only uh, hitch carrier we could find to support that, you know, for the price. There was a Reese that cost a little bit more, but we went to, with this one, which was uh, about $120, and the bag was about $50. So the whole setup, $170, and this is 60 by 24 by 24 out of the box got two pieces we're gonna have the hitch so I'll let you know how hard it is to put together it doesn't look that hard looks like we're just gonna be sliding a couple things together and installing the hitch brace on there uh, a few screws it's supposed to carry 500 pounds this is a 24 by 60 so this is one of the bigger ones supposedly it's able to carry 500 pounds obviously it hits, fits in a standard uh, two inch receiver other than that, it includes the hitch pin. It looks good. So far, it looks good. It arrived to me in pretty good shape from Amazon. So I feel good about that. It's a little heavy, but, I mean, of course, it's going to be since uh, we're looking at that 500-pound capacity. It's got a nice basket. And uh, also, I am going to do a review on a 24 by 24 by 60 bag that's supposed to fit in here. Alright guys, one thing I do want to mention, it was pretty easy to put together, I put it together by, well, actually I could not put it together by myself, I probably could have, but I had some help. They say that you only need a 17 millimeter socket. The problem with that is, these, these bolts, and these down here, are two different sizes, so, not sure how you would just need a 17 millimeter. We used a three quarter on this, and you need one for both sides. And then an 11 16 for these, and you only need it on one side because of the way the nuts are fashioned. But other than that, it was pretty easy. I mean, it just, I had to use a little bit of force to uh, pop them in, and then we just uh, tighten the bolts. So, but right now, this thing's a really sturdy piece. It comes with the pin. So, as of right now, I think it's a pretty good piece of equipment, but we're going to take it on a trip and we'll let you know. Hey, here we are, a little farther on in the trip. We got our bag going. Cargo vault management system going. Man, these are these tie downs seem to be really good. Really strong so far. Really strong tie down points. They haven't caused any issue. And then they got the straps on the other end right here. No issues so far. Pretty pretty happy. Got another stop check in for you guys, man, with this CZC auto bag and the cargo vault management system. We got lost in the middle of Oklahoma, and you can see, man, this thing is dusty. We got trapped on some back roads, and uh, now you can see the ice on it. And uh, she's still holding up, man. So, so far, so good. Once we get to our destination, we'll give it a check out. It will have gone over a thousand miles at that point through back roads, country roads, and dirt roads. And uh, let's see what she looks like. A thousand miles. She's dusty. Huh? But we're fixing to check it out. Look on the inside. See? Did it hold up? Look at that. No dust. I say this bag held up really good for our thousand mile trip along with the cargo vault management system hitch I'd give it a passing grade I'd get it again